The U.S. Army demonstrated its commitment to soldiers and their families in life and beyond during the reinterment of Revolutionary War Private Samuel Howard, May 12, 2017, at Rest Haven Cemetery in Baxter, Kentucky. Descendants also laid to rest the remains of Howard's wife, Chloe, and baby Howard. We are proud of his service to his country and proud of his contributions to Eastern Kentucky. The U.S. Army is taking care of a service member and his family 176 years after his passing. This ceremony is a reflection of the Army's Soldier for Life program that is committed to taking care of soldiers during their service, after their service, and after their passing. The Howard's remains at Wicks Howard Cemetery in Loyal, Kentucky were exhumed in November 2016 when soil movement from a flood control project design deficiency threatened the graves. The reinterment at Rest Haven Cemetery culminates the efforts of the family, local officials, state and congressional representatives, and the U.S. Army Corps of Engineers National District to take care of this patriot and his family. We looked back on a married couple from over a hundred years ago and what they could offer us today more than just moving graves, it was about their lives. We don't often stop to do that these days. I realize, and it helped us anticipate, and I hope it will help you anticipate, that we should always welcome these opportunities with open hands. Howard joined the Continental Army at age 16, braved the encampment at Valley Forge, and stood at Yorktown when the British surrendered. He married his wife Chloe in 1784 and they settled in Harlan, Kentucky in 1796 where they had 12 children and contributed to the development of the region. He died in 1840. This has been a true history lesson for me. As you all that are from here know, I've grown up in Harlan County, lived here my entire life. But I had never really been exposed to Samuel Howard and what he meant to Harlan County. But throughout this process, I have been. Their challenges of survival were much greater than ours today. We are truly blessed. But we all are here today because of their importance to us and the people of Harlan County as a whole. We are here today because of their perseverance. Ready. Eight. Five. Ready. Eight. Ready. Eight. Five. The United States Infantry Regiment, the Old Guard, the oldest active duty infantry unit in the Army, paid tribute to Howard's service during the War for Independence with full military honors. Ma'am, on behalf of the President of the United States, the United States Army, and a grateful nation, please accept this flag as a symbol of appreciation for Samuel Howard's honorable and faithful service. This is Lee Roberts reporting for the Nashville District at Rest Haven Cemetery in Baxter, Kentucky.